what's up guys, Ryan Riggs. Some of us want to keep those Apple iMacs and Apple Thunderbolt displays nice and clean on our desk and organized. The problem is there's no front-facing USB ports. Well, today that changes. We've got some other things we can use that are out on the market, but none of them are going to be as clean as the Whip Labs iMac Companion. This is a front USB port for iMac, designed for iMac as well as Thunderbolt displays. going to give you that front-facing USB 3.0 port. That is correct, a front-facing USB 3.0 port. Let's get it out of the box. We can take a look at it. The great thing about that, nice subtle touch. If you look at it, it opens up like any other Apple product, a nice white box. We'll go ahead and get this iMac Companion out of here. It's a real simple, real sweet USB 3.0 port. Basically, for those that have the iMac or the Thunderbolt display, you do not have a port on the front. This is going to provide you that access. How this is able to do that it's made out of aluminum and sandblasted, so it's going to give you the same aesthetics as your iMac or Thunderbolt display. It has a paper-thin cable, so it's going to pass below the feet of the iMac, so it's going to keep the desk completely cable-free. So we've got iMac Companion by Whip Labs. It's actually double-stick tape, so once we get this set in place exactly where we need it, we'll have that double-stick tape to make sure that it is secure. In this case, I'm going to be using a Thunderbolt display. You can use the iMac as well on the iMacs. You're going to be able to take full advantage of the USB 3.0, whereas Thunderbolt displays only support USB 2.0. Real simple, paper-thin cable. That's what hides underneath the feet of the iMac, or in this case, Thunderbolt display. So let's go ahead and get this old USB 3.0 out of the way. We're going to take our new Whip Labs iMac Companion. You want to get that centered, or if you want to use two or three of them, you could line them up along the bottom. That's your choice. So we're just going to kind of do a dry run here. We're going to get this set into place, get the paper-thin cable under the little feet of the Thunderbolt display so we can get this installed, get it plugged in, and take a look at it in its finished beauty. So we'll get that just kind of wrestled in there just a little bit. Like I said, I haven't pulled the adhesive back yet because I want to just make sure we get a nice dry fit. You can see from the back, still is able to keep the aesthetics looking clean. Simple USB connection. The flat cable is completely hidden from the back. You do not see it from the front. And then we can get the iMac Companion, just kind of get the cable under there exactly where you want it. I'm a little OCD, so it did take me a little longer to get it exactly right. So if you are a perfectionist, you will have no problem getting it right like I did. We'll get it just peel off the back there because it has the adhesive, and that's what's going to stick to the Thunderbolt display feet there, or in your case, iMac, depending on which one you're using. You can use both. So it makes it real convenient for iMac and or Thunderbolt display. Now we have a very simple, clean USB 3.0 port on the front. Like I said, it's made out of aluminum and sandblasted, so it looks identical. It's almost as if the product should have been there. I can tell you right now, first look, review, installation, I am using it. We are proud to use it, proud to work with iMac Companion. For those that are interested in picking up something like this, it is linked down below. You can pick it up from Amazon. However, we suggest picking it up from their website if you're wanting to. You can use discount code TEAMFELL, that is correct, TEAMFELL, and get 15% off your next purchase. For this first look, unboxing, installation, and review of the iMac Companion from Whip Labs. Like I said, use discount code TEAMFELL, save yourself 15% off. If you guys are interested in winning an iMac Companion for yourself, just be subscribed to the channel. One random winner will be announced on March 18th. This is open to everybody. Good luck to you guys. Thanks for watching.